Hello, welcome to Natural Music Tutorials. Um, we are going to do a quick and easy, well not quick in timing, um, but we're gonna do something real, just, it's kind of an easy intro. I'm not saying that you want to sit down and try to figure it out and learn it. Um, some of you may get this right off, some of you may take a few minutes, but I would say if you've played really almost at all, and I mean, this is close to beginner level, um, you're gonna be able to accomplish this intro and it's kind of a soulful, um, just easy intro that fits on a, a slow 4-4 four, four time song. So it's in the key of B-flat. So if we were singing like something in B-flat like, God is so Or, All to Jesus I surrender. So something with just like this rhythm, two, three, four, anything that you can put that to, um, a slow hymn, or it doesn't have to be a hymn, just whatever you choose. So this is just a nice little um, soulful, just easy intro to do. So we're going to go ahead and get in on it. It starts out kind of low on the right hand, um, and you do, it's in the key of B flat, so we're going to do the shell of the B flat, we're going to do um, a D in the thumb. And on the ring finger, we're going to do a uh, B flat. And we're gonna go. And then we're gonna keep that shell movement up to start out. We're gonna go. And we'll go to this E flat to C then. And then F to D. And then after we hit that, we're gonna kinda hit the chord a few times. We'll add the B flat in there. One, two, three, nice and easy. So these first three of this. You can go ahead and hit the chord on that third one. One, two, three. So you do those a little softer than those first opening ones. One, two, three. And then we hit a little bit harder. Again, we're going to play this E flat um, with E flat, B flat, and G in the thumb. You can see if you take these three notes right here, we're just moving the B flat and the G down. Still an E flat chord. Um, it's just we rearranged it from here to here. Um, those three notes make up that um, E flat no matter what. So we're gonna go one, two, three, four. And we're gonna hit that and go right back to it, to a B flat. So in that B flat is D, B flat, and F. So one, two, three, four, one, two, three. And then we'll do it again. One, two, three. So you can see. We're doing one, two, three, then on the four of the count, we do that E flat, two, three, and then on the four of the next count, um, or actually we're gonna do that um, little walk up to again. One, two, three, then on the four of this count, this is probably, I guess, the hardest part of this. Your hands get a little tied together. Um, on the right hand, we'll just deal with the right hand, we'll get to the left hand here in a second. We're going to play that B flat and a D, and then we're gonna use this finger, and we're gonna kinda of just bend that note and go, like that. And then back down to the D. Two, three. So, two, three. And then you got a B flat chord right there if you wanna play it, or you can just play these two. The, the B flat and the D is enough to state that chord but it, I go. I think I go ahead and add the F. One, two, three, and then you're into the song. So it's important that when we're doing these walks and these bends and the things that we really want to pop out, um, we play those a little harder, and then we play like a strumming guitar sound when we're just playing that rhythm nice and soft. Like So we're going one, two, three. That's kind of the melody note, and those can be loud. One, two, three, then soft. Almost where you can barely hear them, and then you want that E flat to come out. And actually when we go back down to that, um, we hit this D and then that B flat. So that's something I didn't mention before. So you're going one, two, three, B flat, like that. And then we'll do that again. we're going to bend this note. Two, three, like that. So 
So the whole right hand is... So that's the right hand, not too bad, not too bad at all. A nice little soulful intro. Um, so the right hand isn't gonna do a whole lot. We're gonna just do a nice octave and really sustain it. So when you go, when you hit that B flat, you're gonna sustain that. You're gonna want to hit that hard because it's gonna have to last a whole lot. I mean, don't overdo it, but. After we do that, after you hit that D on that, we're gonna hit this again. So two, three. See how that is right there? You can do it again. Hit that left hand right there again. Now, so when we get to this bend on the right hand, where we're going, oop, not that bend. You're going to do the same thing down here. Besides, you're gonna go. Together, when you're doing this bend, you're gonna go B flat to C, like that, and then back down to B flat and hit twice, and then just kind of hit an octave like that. So you're gonna to want to kind of practice. One, two, three, and then. Oh, to Jesus I. Definitely not in my key to sing, but um, I'm sure there's a B flat song that you, you will use this on. So this is kind of um, that's pretty much it. Here's both hands together a little bit slow. So. And that's not too bad, um, even that slow. I mean, it, it sounds all right. It just depends on how slow you want to do a song. Um, but this is a nice soulful intro, and you can use this, you know, like, God is so good. So if I were going to put it on that song, it'd sound something like this. So that's it um, for that little one. Nice little easy soulful intro. I hope you got a lot of value out of this and you'll be able to use it in your playing. Thanks so much for joining.